Listen. I think I think the background noise is gone. I think I think it's gone. I cleaned out my computer. It was dog hair that was the culprit. My computer hadn't been cleaned for a couple of months. And with three dogs, two cats and humans, it was quite quite dusty in there. Quite very dusty. Um there's a tiny bit of background noise, but my computer isn't silent and it's quite close by just because the way my desk has to be arranged. But um hopefully it's a lot better. Right, let's get into the proper stuff. Let's play some fucking football. <sighs> <laughs> uh, so so I just reading that uh Roy Hodgson's been linked with the Leicester job. Amazing. Leicester players, be careful what you wish for. Just be careful what you wish for. The mighty Roy Hodgson is coming to save you right greetings and salutations welcome i can't even remember what episode it is 20 20 something episode of the journeyman and we've got a lot to catch up on so let's get straight into it we played a bunch of games since our last pretty shit episode really and we've won a lot and we've drawn one so first we played ascoli and we beat them 3-1 mancini jean-claude jean-claude van damme out of all the strikers i think most people agreed that he would probably struggle the most to get the team not so. I think he's actually our top scorer now. He's just on fire at the moment. Um, and cost of the super sub getting a goal. Then we play Cassina, Cassina. 3-1 again. Jezebel, Jezebel, Jean-Claude Van Damme with a brace. As I can see, he's going to score for funsies. Then we played Atletico Madrid. We needed this win. I wanted to sort of do an episode on that first game, but I thought... We want to get the season underway now. So I thought we'll come back for the second uh, game against Atletico. And we beat them 2-1. Van Doom and Jean-Claude Van Damme with the goals. Then we beat Pescara 2-0. Belletti and Pedroschi with his first of the season. Sampdori we just smashed 4-0. Van Doom and Jean-Claude Van Damme both with a brace. They were both amazing. And then we annoyingly drew against Chievo. Is that right? Did I get it right? Did I get it? It's closer. Um, Jean-Claude Van Damme scored early, then Rita scored, and then uh, Alessandro Galesso scored two goals. 85th minute equaliser. Just didn't put away our chances. We created easily enough to win that. Should have won it. Didn't win it. Drew it. As we can see by the lovely league, we are top of the table. Two points clear from Juventus. Five points clear from Inter. They've actually lost the game already this season, so that's unlike them. We've we're still undefeated. Us and us and Juventus. This could be a two-horse race. I'm I'm amazed. I'm really pleased with how we're playing at the moment. It's absolutely sensational stuff. So today we're going to play Atletico in the Champions League and Salamantitana, who is one of our affiliate clubs in the league. Um, they're not a very good side, so we should smash those. I don't know where they are in the league. Ninth. Okay, maybe not. Champions League Group A is looking much better now after that win. We are now top of the group again. Um, another win, I think, should should give us top two, probably mathematically. Five points to... Not, not quite mathematically, but another win will pretty much guarantee us uh, at least Europa League football, but that's not enough. We're going for this. So, at the moment, this is how we're sort of lining up. De Vita is taking the number one spot from um, the Fresh Prince. Uh, Rita at right back. Alvinini was playing at left back because that's Connor up because he got a lot of suspension. He banny things, so we had to get rid. Um, but he's back now. Uh, Ivan Silva's come back in. He's still not quite... I'm probably going to drop him for this game. I'm, I'm, he's just sort of getting used to the team, I think, still. So we're going to bring the legend that is Ochna back in. Um, look at the centre-back ratings there. It's ridiculous. 10 games, 7.85 rating for the centre-back. Um, Connor up. Yeah, he's, he's quite good at football. 8.07. He's back in. Party has actually done remarkably well. He's not played as much this season, which probably done him good, being that he's 33 years old. So he's just sort of in and out, swapping with Kaza. Um, and he's actually providing a bit more. Four assists already so far. Pedroshi in the middle doing his bit. Chris Colo, not... Fantastic. He missed the penalty last game. He's done all right. I'd like to see a couple more goals and assists out of him. Van Doom is just Van Doom. He just does what he wants. Jean-Claude Van Damme, eight goals in six starts is absolutely sensational. Belletti's like, no chance. Five in ten. That's quite good normally. No, not Van Damme. He's, uh, he's up for this. Right, let's get straight into it. Let's do it. It was a pretty close game um, in, the first, uh, in the first game against Atletico. We deserve to win overall. They are favourites, but, you know, what does that mean? Um, yeah. 
Fine margins. That's all I read about that question. Okay, nobody fancies us to win. Go on then. Go on, Yap. Let's see. I, I, why trust the Yap? Don't. Let, let's give them a good boost. Bit of faith. Bit of faith, boys. Come on. Away from home. This is a massive match. Win oh, what the fuck are we playing on? A muddy carpet. Okay, look at that. <laughs> look at the trousers and shirt tie combo. Amazing. All right, I think with my outfit, I think you can possibly see me from the moon. Um, it's so bright. Here we go on this horrible pitch. <clears throat> Belletti needs to pick his ideas up. He's not been great the last couple of games. And Jean-Claude is naturally a target man, so he can easily slot in. This is kind of last chance for a little bit. Maybe he just needs a break. All right, are we going to get an early chance here, Van Doom? No, no. Oh, no. Nick tip back. Connor up. Connor up. Oh, right foot blast. 30 seconds in. Little sighter from Connor up. <clears throat> he's just, I think he scored three goals this season, which is quite a lot. People sort of saying that, you know, the overpowered fullbacks and stuff. But if you think about my actual, the way that our, my team plays, they're actually wingers, really. In all but position, they're attacking. I push them forward further. Even Rita is not a fullback. He's got no fullback stats. <laughs> That's how wingerish these guys play. Um, all they need to do is have the legs to get back. That's pretty much the only difference. Right. Either it's snowing. Party! Yes! There ain't no pie like a Thomas Pye's first goal of the season. It could prove to be a massive goal. It's either snowing lightly or there's been a nuclear blast and this is the fallout. It's it's weird snow. Look at that. Party. The old man still... He looked like he kicked it through the guy's testicles. But okay, we'll take that. Right. 1-0 up. Not creating great chances. It's pretty even um, on the decent chances. Floats one to the back post. Party's there. Oh, he's up for this today. He's a legend. I love Thomas Party. I hope he becomes a staff member. I might take him with him as a staff member because he's 33 now. Um, more of the same. Yep, let's do that. I like that. No changes to be made. All good. What I'll do now, beginning from this episode and onwards, if I, if and when I remember, is that I'm going to look at the job list at the end of each episode just to see, you know, if there's any jobs available, but also what jobs could be potentially coming up in the future. And then if there's any little gems, we might have a talk about them. It's hard to leave right at this moment while we're top of the league and top of the Champions League group admittedly um but it's always nice to keep an eye if there's a massive one it might be hard to turn it down that's a decent ball across he's hit the post it's okay okay i'm gonna drop this to, they're coming back at us quite heavily here let's drop this to counter do we need to get rid of anybody i think everybody's still pretty fit rita with a throw to party he's up for this today ball in oh that's a good header away diogo ball forward it's two on two we're trying to get back. We're trying to get back. Oh, he's missed the tackle. Oh, my Lord, he's missed it. Juan. I watched... I'm on to season four of Game of Thrones now. And I just watched the episode where... Um, I won't say the characters, just in case. Spoilers, even though it's quite old now. Um, somebody... Oh, he's hit the post. Somebody literally popped another man's head. Popped it. Squeezed it so hard, he popped it. <laughs> it was quite surprising. Van Doom's knackered, okay. Um, we've got... I am playing Blanco in there, actually. Let's give it a go. And then we'll go for Kostov as the central midfielder. Just to freshen up that midfield. It's a very close game now. We're just trying to hold on. Cheeky can't concentrate, it's needed. It's... Go, quickly, quickly. No, Blanco. Kostov, two subs linking together. Party, is he going to hit another one? No, he's dinked it out to Connor up. Is he going to fire one in? Go on, near post. Ah, oh, is he cleared away? Are we looking for a counter attack here? Look, Connor up running back. <laughs> he's just going. <laughs> he's not even looking where the ball is. He's like, I better get back. I left the cooker on. All right, Pedroshi. Oh, that's poor Pedroshi, but he's kept hold of it. Kostov. Okay, this has got a bit scrappy. Belletti. Come on, man. You've not done much the last few games. Party. John Claude, Blanco, Belletti. No, mate. No. That was that was not good. That was a lovely little move. And you fudged it up. Um Jezebel swapped them two over. Come on, see it out, boys. See it out. Please. 
Let's go defensive. I'm panicking. Three minutes left. One and a half minutes. Oh, no, there's, there's enough time here, boys. Keep keep the ball. Keep the ball. Keep the ball. If I sing it, they'll do it. Just keep the ball. Okay, Jean-Claude. Jean-Claude! Oh, he's in the post again. <laughs> Unlucky, mate. Unlucky. He's been on fire recently. This should be enough now, surely. Surely. Does anyone know why the big some of the big stadiums have the corners missing? <laughs> Imagine sitting right on the top, on the edge there. Like, literally. If you're scared of heights, you're going to shit yourself. Like, just keep it. I'll, I'll just fire it in. You know, that works as well. Oh, this is... We're getting to the stage where we're playing this, these top teams now. And, we're, you know, in the league, we're crushing quite a lot of opposition. But now these, these are getting a bit tricky. That's a lovely ball out from Van Damme. There it is. 1-0 victory. We'll take that all day long. Pretty even game. We did a lot of shut people up there. Shut them up. There are nine points now. Five points clear. Six points over Leon. We're definitely champions uh, staying in the Europe at least. Toledo. Let's have a look at their key man. Yeah, he's, he's not bad. Not bad. Right. Let's have a look. 1.2 million. We're still in debt. We still hover around this much debt. It's great. Right, let's move on to the next game. This should be a crushing. All right, a little bit of good news here. Um, Steve Brown, the infamous goalkeeper now, um, is now five appearances away from making 50 appearances, which means we'll get paid £2.5 million. I like it when those little extras come in because you completely forget about them and it's just bonus money. Right, Chris Colo suspended for this one. I might risk playing my backup fullbacks on this one. Hang on, we got international duty, so they're not playing for a while anyway. Okay, forget that then. Forget that. Um, I'm going to drop Belletti. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to bring Blanco in, swap them two over. Um, Chris Colo will go for Kaza. I No, Lundberg, I'm trying to play as a little bit more of a central midfielder now. Um, and he's done all right, so I think we'll do that. Do we play one of our, the centre-backs? Do we give Ivan Silva another go? It's not exactly playing bad. It's like he's seven point two nine in eight games. It's just that these guys are playing so well. Um, let's give Ochner a rest. I think I want to sort of I want to bed him into the squad. He is the best player, attribute wise. He's just learning the language and getting used to playing with our players. So I think that's what we'll do. Um, anybody else? Right, need a big game from Blanco. He's the important one here. Jezebel and Blanco fighting for this. Uh, I've got only got 11 subs. Okay, you can go on the bench. Yeah, Blanco and Jezebel at the moment are fighting over that spot. Like number 32, because I know how you guys like it when I really think about what numbers I give to players. <laughs> right. They're a pretty. I looked at their team earlier. They're a pretty rubbish team, but they're doing all right in the league so far. So we can't take them too lightly. Right, ba, 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 ba. to the favourites, go out, oh, crush them, crush them! Right, here we go, boys. Oh, we need to look at attendance after this game. Remind me, okay? You can't, but I remind myself. I need to look, because we're, we're edging up. I feel like we're edging up on the attendance, especially top of the league. Surely we should be getting a few more fansies in the door now. Right, let's just get this killed off nice and early, and then we can all go about our day. Please, game. Nice 3-0 victory, please. Okay, Lundberg's taking a knock. He should recover. Doesn't look like he's injured. Okay, this is quieter than our normal starts of a game. One shot that was a long shot. It's fine. Let's not, let's not worry about it. <sighs> Come on, boys. They just like literally nothing's happening at the moment. Right, here we go. 20 minutes gone. What's going on here? We've got less possession. We've not had many shots. Okay, Lundberg's now booked. Okay, first highlight, 24 minutes in. Is it going to be ours? Connor up wins that header. Van Doom. He's got a pass in his locker. There's Connor up making his usual run. He's got two to beat. He falls over kind of before he got to the first one. But he's got back up. He's chasing back. Oh, he's stolen it back. He's just... I love him. He's amazing. 
That's decent ball, Van Doom. Lundberg, nobody. Right, here we go. This is goal time. Party. Lovely ball across Lumbo. Ping it, ping it. Okay, I'll just faff about with it for ages. Counter attack. Angel. Or Angeli. Good, good defensive work. Oh, they've got it back though, and we've just left that space massively open. Suzo, is that the Liverpool reject, Suzo? Oh, decent. Is that a save? The Vita is actually proving to be a very good goalkeeper. This is a weird game so far. This is not. Are we getting a bit complacent here? It feels like. I'm worried that we're just getting a bit complacent with our play here. We should be beating these comfortably. Van Doom with a good tackle. Breaks away. Plays an early ball. It's Blanco all on his own. He's got a lot to do. He's charging at the defence. Cuts inside. Beats one. Lundberg. It's gone a bit wide with it. Dinks it back post. Party! Oh, that's a great save with the feet. But he should have scored it. Okay, it's better, boys. Better. Lundberg with the corner. Right into the mixer. Oh! Silver there, unlucky mate, unlucky. It's better, it's better. I'm, I'm a little bit worried, less worried now. The chances are starting to build up. I mean, possession, we normally absolutely crush people on possession. Party's been booked, that's a little bit of a worry. Yeah, we normally crush people on possession. Connor up's been booked. He gets a lot of yellow cards, but he seems to know where the line is. Uh, now I've said that, he's going to get himself sent off. Okay, Party picks it up in, in space. Dinks one over. That's just wasteful party. Header forward. Mm. Not liking that. What's going on, boys? What's going on? This is a great tackle, though. Slowed him up at least. Suzo. Mendez. They're going backwards. Force him back. Okay. Gabrielli. Oh, don't, don't do anything silly. Oh, I shouldn't have said it. I shouldn't have said it. I shouldn't have said it. Oh, why did I say it? Why did I say it? I just, I've just basically cursed the FM gods there, haven't I? I've, I've. Oh, that's annoying. So the obvious option here is either go Van Doom or a striker. I'm tempted to go striker. It's going to be Blanco. Tar do we want target man support? Yeah, no, I okay. We'll go with that. We can still win this game, boys. We can still win this game. Don't worry about it. We're still better than them, even with 10 men. Although possession is probably going to be even more of an issue now. We might just go counter-attacking, I think. Would I take a draw at this point? <laughs> would I take a draw at this point? No, I don't think I would. I think I think we can still beat them. We've been unlucky. Oh, Connor up. Why you do this to me, man? I'm a little bit worried about party as well, being on a yellow. And he's looking nervous. We'll save the last sub. Okay. Oh, this is going to be a very tense 45 minutes. Come on. We drew that last league game. We don't want to drop more points. Inter are winning. Juventus haven't played. I prefer chasing overall. I don't like being top of the table and, and trying not to drop points. I kind of like chasing somebody. Okay. 60 minutes gone. There's three of us around it. We should get that away, but is it going to come back? Van Doom, if he can steal it, we could break. No, it doesn't look like it. Suzo, Mendes. Oh, Pedroshi's just been sent off. Oh no, he's not. Even, he's not even looking at the referee. He's like side by side. You sending me off? Yeah, I am. Why are we standing like this? I don't know. Ah, oh, okay. It's looking like an interesting form. I don't think there's much to be changed. <laughs> I think we might need to go less attacking. I'm not giving up on this game. I'm not giving up on a win here. We're going to get a nine-man win, and we'll all be rejoiced. And I'll have a statue. <laughs> it's looking a bit limited though isn't it in numbers the numbers are looking interesting um okay we'll set i'm going to send you right up top 
as our like out ball here. Van Doom's going to slot back into midfield. We still want him to support it a bit, so we're going to put him there. Um, and then we're going to change quite drastically how we play. So we're going to go more direct, nice and quick. Um, don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. And that. And that. Basically, punt it up to Jean-Claude is the option here. Uh, Jean-Claude. Oh, okay. We're going to stay on counter. I'm not giving up the hope of a win here. This is what could make us champions. This sort of result. Even a draw would be sensational now, but I'm, I'm going for the win. We're going for this, boys. Maybe a horrible mistake, but fuck it. Just don't score right away, because that's just disappointing then. Good header away from Rita. By Rita, even. Back of Blo with the ball. Lazzarini. Suzo pulling the strings. Okay, they're coming around. Easy save for the keeper. Right. 30 minutes left. Oh, God. Okay. It's fine. I right, punt it. <laughs> I might bring... Have we saved... Have we got a sub left? I think we've got a sub. Look, look at him. Bless him. He's like, what the fuck do I do? That's it. That's it, mate. Good it. I think we should bring somebody with more pace on, which would be Jezebel. If you can score, Jezebel, you'd be a hero. 25 minutes gone. <laughs> Come on. I can't believe I talked about yellow cards and stuff. It's just tempting fate. They still only had two shots, right? Three shots, okay. 15 minutes left. Oh, this game is going... Look at the yellow cards in the bottom there. Jesus Christ. 10 minutes left. Come on, we're going to steal this. I'm, I'm confident. Come on. Go on. Oh, no. 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 We can't get this far and then concede. Come on, please. Don't do this. Lundberg, don't do anything stupid. Oh, that's kind of stupid. Don't get sent off, for Christ's sake. Four of you around him. One of you make a tackle. Just keep it back. Keep them forcing them back. That's it. Oh, no. 20 seconds left. Come on. Don't do it. Oh, this is they're taunting me here. Just passing it around. That's it. Force them back again. I like it. Suzo, he is pulling the strings today. Oh, no. This is it. This is the ball in. The killer ball. No, it's not, because Rita makes a tackle, even though he can't tackle for shit. He's the Paul Scholes of tackling, and we've drawn it nil-nil. I never thought I'd be celebrating a nil-nil draw with a shit team, but... No, I'm not going to say... Yap, did you watch the game, yeah? Blame the two players that got sent off. Don't tell everybody else it's unacceptable. They were playing with nine men. I'm going to say they're unlucky. Oh... Man, okay, so it is drop points, but after that game, I'll take it. I'll take a nil-nil draw with nine men. Party, uh, Connacht's banned. I'll give him a warning. Standard warning for two yellows, unless they do it loads, and then I will start fining. But they've not been sent off much, so goalless Blanco, yeah, yeah, he doesn't worry me. We've got plenty of others. Right, everybody's accepted their warning. Right, let's before we finish up, let's have a look in the uh, job centre. See if there's any any big, big clubs. Although it'd be silly to leave right at this moment. But I just want to have a look. Just have a nose. Um, mm, 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 mm. So we've got a couple of insecure ones there. They're their countries. We've got Colne and we've got Sevilla. Mm. They're both quite cheeky. Secure finances. Uh, Huddersfield, Newcastle, still not want to go. I don't want to go to England. That's it at the moment. Okay, not too much on there. Right, we're done for the... Oh, hello. Throw me headphones everywhere. Um, thank you very much for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the episode. Please like if you did. Subscribe if you're new. Share it with your friends and all that good stuff. One thing before I just absolutely remembered at the very end of this episode. Hold on a moment. Because um, I totally forgot, even though I'd actually written it down. What's the point in writing it down? And uh, we have new Patreons who I want to say a big thank you to. Um, and that is Nodar who upped his um, Patreon donation to $5. Thank you so much, mate. Appreciate it. Um, and we've got others. I, I can't see them. Like, 
<laughs> I'm just crying now. Um, Matthew Deakin, I've already said him. But Matthew Deakin, thank you again. Wow, this was really well done. I'm so professional at this sort of shit. Right, thank you very much for watching, guys. See you in the next episode. Bye-bye. <laughs> Roy Hodgson. Roy Hodgson. <laughs>